so i'm going to start the session now this is the workday hcm landing screen okay this is how the workday hcm techno functional landing screen will be available at the moment so you people can see the home screen button on here okay this is called it has a home screen button okay once you people tap onto this button it will take you from the home screen wherever you people has been working in the tenant access and coming to the next option would be at search bar navigation this is call it has a search bar navigation we will call this search bar navigation in the workday language it's an workday google search bar it's an workday google search bar whatever the product we are going to cover okay the complete a to z each and every scenario we can able to identify those related details tasks activities report related details okay for example take it as an example usually we will use the work day tenant for the three i know things one is like you know uh, reports and other one is as tasks other one is activities okay reports take it as an example you needed some salary report you can come here enter here s a l a r y salary report whatever the reports has been whatever the reports has been tied up to your particular you know workday id it will give you the complete details of reports to you or you want to check some activity kind of dashboard related activities you need you know dashboard of compensation so you can have a direct tap on you know dashboard you people receive the you know compensation benefit dashboard report on here okay this is call it as an activity or you wanted certain tasks how to create a supervisor you can enter here create a supervisor create supervisor on here directly okay so you people will get create a supervisory organization task on below you people can able to see from here right so this is how you need to maintain your work. search bar navigation from a to z work day related complete a to z related information you people can find through the search bar navigation okay and coming to the third option you can able to see here when you scroll your cursor little bit you can see there was a work day assistance work day assistance is nothing but guys you know whenever you people having any technical issues like you know whenever you people working in some reports data or activity tasks related okay information related activities to people working you have an option called you know workday assistance in this workday assistance you people will get and you know the complete information related a robotic support i hope you people was been well aware whenever you people visit you know our website like people are aware about uh, google alexa or you people are aware about iphone siri okay whenever if we ask something automatic the robotic you know uh, questions and answers it will uh, you know we will get it from the robotic reply from the software okay like that the workday assistance is going to be an help to you people whenever you people stuck in any activity task or report related area you can have a tap on to the workday assistant enter your error automatically system is going to be and reply to you you need to follow those troubleshoot points to fix your error for the temporary basis if the issue is really very major or serious then take a screenshot loop into the outlook outlook in the sense it's an email okay loop into your email and loop to your you know team leader and your team senior members and ask the things to be and fix it as soon as possible they're going to work on your ticket to fix the issue as soon as possible on the same and coming to the next to that you people can able to see the you know bell mark the bell mark is going to be and help you the notification and once you people has been joined has in work day l1 l2 l3 l4 consultants or any of the consult any of the you know uh, kind of uh, marketing related uh, you know consultant in the organization work day consultant you people will get the complete work day notifications kind of you know border notifications other related data 
other related data information all this you will get it into the notification bell mark okay take it as an example i would like to see you people on here leave forget about this board days okay i request to please see about this iphone change of detection okay just look into for 2 minutes this slide and i will explain you later i know everyone having a different view of understand once i you know once i given a answer to you people just recall yourself whether you was thought on the right way or you need to change of your thought process something while looking to the notification block okay just look into for the 2 minutes thank you so you people can see this email has been received 2 hours ago and it's related to the alert notification details okay you can see the right hand side there was a three options what is this three options one is an export this email this activity enter related stuff you can have an export from here and you can have and download it okay you people can see the what exactly is this file is going to be and helps to the employee today i am just giving an tool introduction to you people i am not going to taking you through any tasks related okay so this is how the reports we will get since this is a training tenant we received only you know five to six uh, you know steps of the content related activity this is all about the notification you know view all option once you tap on to the view all option okay we can see the all and unread if you tap on to the all we will get you know 1 to 30 days of the report 1 to 30 days of the you know notification related activities if you wanted the unread only unread it so you will get this 68 unread notifications in an sequence you people can see the sequence on here 2 hours ago 2 hours ago it will keep increasing 4 hours ago 5 hours ago 6 7 13 18 20 one day two day three day four day it will keep increasing so coming to this unread you can able to see the sequence wises and day wises weekly wises month wises also and coming to this just have a tap on to the all the next to that you can see the sort by okay and in this you can able to see newest on top in a sequence okay on below you can able to tap oldest on the top okay if you tap on to the newest on the top okay you will get the sequence wise is complete no notifications one to 30 days if you want to oldest data want to has on top you will get 31 to 6 months data ago 31 to 6 months data ago and coming to that i'm just tapping on to the newest on top and view all option i'm tapping on to the unread notifications and i'm tapping on to this arrow mark in this i have an two options one is refresh refresh you people was aware about it whenever you people did not receive immediate notification have a refresh and check and what about this mark has an read if you tap on mark all has a read whatever the 68 notification you have the pending to watch you can mark has all read okay you will get the complete notifications has been empty no your notification blogger has no empty see here earlier it was showing 68 no it's showing an zero and just come to the main menu tap on to the inbox this is call it has an inbox okay so this is very crucial uh, you know uh, tool utilization at workday 
any task, any report related activity, any dashboard related activities, any functional related activities, any technical integration, EIB report related activities, all these activities will come and stored in your inbox. Okay. If people can see, I have almost 2033. 2033, you know, tasks has been pending still today, till today. Okay. And coming to this, if people can see here, I have an actions and achieve. So coming to this actions, the viewing all, I have in certain options. In this certain options, I have like, you know, all favorites, overdue, delegated, all to DOS. Okay. Rest below is all Arjun, Shri, and these all names is there. No, This is something where we created related to the studio activities. Okay has an workday hcm consultant senior or l1 you people will get the live tenant till here all to device live tenant clear let's discuss about what is meant by all and favorites have a tap on to the all i received an you know scheduled interview on gps engineer this is the details it was been 35 minutes ago it's related to the business process and I seen step audit related activities. Okay. If I want to check now this ticket related, I understand easily what is this ticket since I have an experience. What about if any new guy was looking out of this, you know, body of the email, definitely he may fall under to the multiple questions while looking to look into this task. Okay. Do not worry. So first we understand this five things that we understand what is this task related and how to identify what exactly is related to this task and the first point is we need to understand you know the star mark okay what is this star mark the star mark is related to end favorites okay if you would like to make this email has very important to you or you would like to work after four hours, you can make it has a star mark. Immediately it will turn into the blue color. On here, you people can see has an yellow color of the star blocker. And what we make has a favorite business process, unassigned step audit related activity, schedule interview, Denny P. And next to that, you people can see whenever you would like to, you know, export this task to be an you know report or file whatever uh, the segmented you know criteria you would like to check that particular task you people need to tap on to the export to has an excel once you tap on to the export to has an excel okay you can get an download option have a download the complete task will get an information has an file have I opened that file? So this is the file. I know while watching this file, what is this mean by reassigning events, date, business process, step, security groups, workers, organization. To understand this, we have an, you know, individual tasks and we have an, you know, entire course content is waiting for us. To understand this, this is what the report related. While watching this report, I know what exactly I need to do this report. Why? Because I know these all things as very well in the past 16 years of my career. Okay. Next option is all PDF. If you, you would like to convert this to be an PDF, yes, you can able to convert my dear. You can have a tap onto this option. It will convert to direct PDF from here. You can have an export the file from here and you will get an download option and you can able to download it from here on the same. It's taking a while, just give me a minute here. Yeah. It's taking a tap to the download. So you can see in the desktop, the file is going to be downloaded and I'm just opening that file. So this is called the complete business process. And as in step audit, how many pages we received it? 52. How many? 52 guys. You know, you people will take the time to complete this task and minimum four to five hours easily. I 
and come back again. And what is about, you know, you can able to see there was a, some settings icon over there. So the settings icon is the one of the route leaded to the accept this task from your ID. Okay. If you tap on this option, you will get a notification view details. Whenever you would like to check this task details, you cannot read this, you know, highlighted, uh, you know, this uh, subject and below is the whatever the, you know, title they given to you while reading this, you cannot understand anything. Okay. You people need to go on to the tap on to the settings icon. You need to tap on to the view details, view details. Then only you people can able to understand this view recruiting event. It's an just an recruiting event to the interview, Danny P, the person. Okay. And this is the employee ID and his details. There was been hired for the, you know, direct employee. One particular individual hired, they was they did it. For that, you know, there is a request to us and for the business process interview calls and subject related, there was been updated. And you can see the details from here, my actions and details. Under the details, you can find the which person has been assigned this to you. And Smith is assigned this to you. And you can find the Smith landline number. And you can see the employee resume on here. And experience details has been updated on here on the same. This is how you need to identify the detailed information about the particular ticket. And have a tap on to the full screen modem. You can work as a full screen mechanism on this particular task related activity. And coming to the below, go on to the favorites. You people can able to see whatever you marked as a favorite. See, schedule an interview. Danny P, the people can able to see. So coming to the next point, yes, this is call it has an favorites blogger. And coming to the next one is all about the overview. What is mean by overview? If any task is assigning from the other teams, they should give you the tat also. Few teams ask you to complete this work in within one hour, two hours, three hours, four hours, 24 hours, 48 hours. They'll give you a time of tat is within the hours. You need to complete the task within the hours to the particular department. You can see the overdues. You have all this, you know, task is, is being overdue in your account. You did not complete it. Since this is a training tenant, we can show you these things. But being an employee and working in an organization, if you show your overdue, And if we showing like this, okay, definitely there was a chance of leads to you terminated in the organization. Okay. So please clear your tickets once it's received to you. If it is any delay, update into the particular team and along with your team leader that why it's taking and time. Okay. Post that you can make hold those tickets in your bucket. Until unnecessary, please do not take in for granted this activity of related to the overdue. Delegated to me. What is mean by delegated to me? Someone will tag you certain projects or certain individual departments related work. Individually, they will tag to you. Okay. Those related tasks, emails will be sent into the delegated to you. That means they will, they want only you to work those particular relevant tasks. Clear? And coming to that all to do's. What is mean by all to do's is all related to the documents related if someone i know sharing certain documents to you or you may go into implemented certain documents to you all those document related tasks tickets will be received to the all to do's clear this i'll explain you later to people you may get confused if i start explaining this ticket related activity as per scenario i'm going to teach you what exactly we need to do what exactly we not to do as well Coming to that, all the DOS related activities, you people can able to see the edit filters, edit filters. Okay. If you want to create your name of inbox, you can have a go and tap on to the edit filter, go and tap on to the edit filter. If you go and tapping on to the edit filter,
you people can able to see the the complete related you know whatever the you know filters you already created those related information to so people can able to see and you have an option called create inbox filter have a tap on this create inbox filter once you tap on to the create inbox filter you will get an you know the complete description of create inbox filter on here in this you can enter your name like you know there was a lot of people i'm not going to enter anyone's name so limit of the emails i'm just mentioning 200 to i can mention 2000 also it's a depends on myself so i'm just mention only 200 as of now and i need to select here for all business process coming to the tasks i need to mention here task in inbox in this we need to select has an approval attached document dos if anyone given any task related it will reach to directly to my name and if anyone given any document related attached uh, document creation related it will come to you the direct to my you know name of inbox if anyone shared any dos dashboard related activities it will reach to my name of inbox directly okay and post that you people can have a tap on to that okay so i got here my suresh inbox on here tap on to the done come to the main menu all dos and you can see here suresh inbox on here directly and coming to this tap on to the sorted uh, so this is what is all about the you know actions view all you know details from here and coming to that sort by the newest sort by the newest okay in the hus have a tap on this option you can able to see the newest newest 1 to 30 days you will get it and oldest you will get it 31 to 6 months and due soonest has i already discussed with you whatever the due tasks you people having all those related due related tasks will be appeared on here you do you will also get the option called you know mark has on approved all the tasks on your live tenant since this is training tenant i did not get that option but do not tap on that option when you people see that option in the inbox if you by mistakely done also you know the tasks will be go keep approval all the tasks at one shot it may leads you to terminate in the organization okay have a tap on to the refresh to find the new emails my delegated emails you know it was been looped to you and your inbox name of your inbox related activities you can able to find it out there okay so this is what about the inbox guys and have a tap on to the profile in this profile you can able to see 
you know the thomas and below that you can able to see the details of home page my account work page site map favorites how to handle the work day drive and my reports and documentations recovery assistance okay guys that's all for the day